Hi, I'm Ross Brackenridge. Uh, this is a first of a series of uh, very short videos where we just give you a sneaky peek of uh, some of the advanced modules that are within interactive petrophysics software. So here we are in IP, the interactive petrophysics interface. Uh, and you can see if we go to the case tool menu, we have a variety of case tool modules. So we can interpret data from various sources all in one place and also alongside uh, open hole petrophysical interpretations all in the same package. Uh, today, I want to give you a very quick look at the cement evaluation module. This is what it looks like, where we can set up the module to handle all the uh, various, uh, well, most co common logging tools on the market from all the various service companies, from basic CBLs to more uh, the modern advanced tools. Um, we then have the ability to launch an interactive plot uh, where we can do a variety of things like choosing where our collars are, setting our expected cutoffs for cement strength, building up a new cement map, getting our cement coverage, showing where channels are, interactively choosing where our uh, cement is connected to the formation. Ultimately, we end up with a traffic light system here that's green for the best cemented zones, uh, amber for partially cemented zones, and then um, red where the, the, the cement has not met the criteria at all. And uh, that can also be looked at in table form. So where, here we have the, the best cemented zones within the well, and we can generate a automated report that summarizes the parameters used and uh, those results that can be sent to PDF, Excel or Word document. Um, so you can see we can very quickly go from raw data from a CBL tool to providing a clear conclusion on the condition of cement downhole. If you'd like to know more about the workflow for cement evaluation, please contact us using these uh, email addresses or use the, the links on the post to find out a bit more. And we'll get back to you. Thank you.